Hi Anna, good evening. Well, as you can probably tell, it is really windy out here. These gusts are getting up to 50 to 60 miles an hour in some parts of the valley, and they're not gonna die down in the next couple of days. Now, we were talking a little bit earlier about how all this wind can mean a few coughs here and there for us, but with people for more with more serious respiratory issues, that can mean big health concerns. Earlier today, I caught up with Yuma Regional Medical Center's Dr. James Lenhart. He says there are lots of other things floating around in the air other than dust particles. It's dust. Uh, there are lots of um, particles in it that are not only just dirt, but call it uh, allergy. Uh, animal debris, vegetable debris, um, a variety of small particles in the air that when they're inhaled are inflammatory. Dr. Lenhart also told me that if you have asthma or other respiratory issues, there are a few things that you can do to breathe a little bit easier. Stay indoors. Um, don't smoke or breathe or breathe anything else that's um, irritating to the lungs. Uh, if they have a, an inhaler, they should use it frequently to um, reduce the amount of shortness of breath they may be having. Now, Dr. Lenhart says that if you think you may be having a serious asthma attack or other respiratory issue, it's best to play it safe and contact your doctor or head to the emergency room for treatment. But like Nicole's been telling us, these winds are going to die down by the end of the week. Then we can all breathe a big sigh of relief. I'm Anna Hayes. I'll send it back to you in the studio.